Good morning children, it's Mrs Mystery here, Tuesday the 2nd of March 2021. Today's spag lesson, spellings, punctuation and grammar. Today's spag lesson children is on adverbs. Copy out the sentences below. Add an adverb to make your sentence more interesting. Remember children, an adverb describes a verb. For example, the girl jumped becomes the girl jumped happily. The adverb there is happily. Now add adverbs to the following sentences. How did you do? Let's have a look. These are the adverbs I have chosen for the sentences. The children ran down the hill carefully. The man slammed down the phone noisily. She opened the door nervously. What adverbs did you use? Today's learning question children for English is Can I plan a set of instructions? Steps to success I can use bullet points to plan a set of instructions I can plan my instructions using the what makes a good mind map I can sequence my instructions Yesterday, we looked at what makes good instruction writing. What do you need to include in instruction writing? What is an imperative verb? What would happen if the instructions were in the wrong order? Let's remind ourselves on what makes good instruction writing. You need to include time conjunctions, imperative verbs, a title, what you will need list, a new line for each instruction, subheadings, sequence steps, numbers to show order, short clear sentences and often there are handy tips or hints. Today we are going to plan a set of instructions on how to take care of a pet hedgehog. What do you think a pet hedgehog might need? Let's think back to the story of the hedgehog. What kind of food did Max and his family enjoy eating? What games did Petuna, Peony and Pansy like to play with Max? What did the hedgehog sleep on? Before we plan our instructions, we need to think of all the things we will need to take care of a hedgehog. Let's create a mind map. So a hedgehog would need a big shiny cage. It would need leaves for a bed, water to drink, something delicious to eat like fat slimy slugs, juicy wriggly worms, a toy to play with and definitely would need love and care. All pets need love and care. We also need to think of imperative verbs and time conjunctions. Here is a list of some you can use. Imperative verbs include find, get, give, feed, play, make, put and time conjunctions include first, then, next, secondly after, later, finally.
This is an example of the planning format you will use to plan your instructions. You can collect yours from the school office. Here is an example of a plan. What other imperative verbs and time conjunctions can you add to the plan? You also need to add more to the what you need box. Then draw in your instructions. The first one is done for you. Look back on the slide 9 for imperative verbs and time conjunctions. So your independent activity today, children, is to use the planning format to plan a set of instructions on how to take care of a pet hedgehog. Remember, the plan has been started for you. You need to add more to it. For example, what other imperative verbs can you add? What other time conjunctions can you add? What other information do you need in the what you need box? Draw your instructions. The first one has been done for you. And finally, orally rehearse your instructions. Good luck, children.